Hey, man, if you're looking for the most affordable, most beginner-friendly version of Auto-Tune, well, you're looking for the new Auto-Tune Access 10. Oh, what's up, fam? I'm Wavy Wayne from wavywayne.com, and I'm here to help you record and mix better and faster. And today, we are gonna make it really, really easy for y'all with the new Auto-Tune Access 10 update. Let's check it out. Now, Auto-Tune Access is the cheapest version of Auto-Tune, the most beginner-friendly version of Auto-Tune, but it's still going to give you that iconic Auto-Tune sound. How do they do it, man? If we check out the plugin, you will see how simple it is, man. First thing first, you can actually determine whether you want to be working in the light mode or dark mode. They give you these two different color options. Let's go ahead and stick with the dark mode for now. You'll see that we got two buttons at the top that make it really easy to choose the the type of tuning that you're working with. You can go from natural. And I won't go nowhere without you. I designed my life around you. Or you can choose an extreme setting. And I won't go nowhere without you. I designed my life around you. I won't go. And of course, you can mix and match between the retune speed and the humanized setting to get the exact sound that you're looking for. For me, I'm thinking we're going to go with a medium retune speed and maximum humanized for this. Let's listen. And I won't go nowhere without you. I design my life around you. I won't go. Yeah, I actually like that, man. So you see how easy it is to change between the three settings on the retune speed, slow, medium, fast. We got three settings on the humanized. We got off, minimum, and maximum. And literally, that's pretty much it to the plugin. But there's another feature. It's the play notes feature. Now, I think this is dope. This can help you with ear training and also help you maybe find notes that don't work for your composition. So you can easily jump on play notes and then use the on-screen keyboard to click around and play the notes. And if you find a note that doesn't work for the composition that you're working on, simply just go to remove notes, select that note, and it won't be used whenever repitching. <laughs> I like that. I was able to easily find the key of this song and broadcast it to the Auto-Tune Access by using the Auto-Key 2 plugin. They've even improved the integration so that if Auto Key 2 detects a chromatic scale, they can broadcast that over to the Auto Tune Access as well. You can't go wrong with this combination. And just as quickly as this tutorial begins, it's over because the Auto Tune Access 10 is literally that easy. This is the most affordable, beginner friendly version of Auto Tune yet. And you can get it right now as part of the Auto Tune Essential subscription for just $24.99 for the whole year. Or you can opt for the perpetual license and get it from autotune.com. Be dope.